Hey guys and girls and whoever's listening to this, I want to say I hope everyone's doing well in this crazy world we're living in right now. I'm walking outside and it's a beautiful day here in New York as far as the weather goes. Now as far as everything else goes, that's, uh, that's not too good. Um, just some numbers for you, for you guys. Um, 25% of people will not be going back to a gym. Just think about that. So you have you have these big these big gyms. You've got the LA Fitnesses. You've got the the Snap Fitnesses. You got the World's Gyms. And then you got well Gold's Gyms. They they filed they filed bankruptcy um, for starters. But 25% of, of people won't be going back to gym. So I just don't see how a person that's living paycheck to paycheck right now is going to be able to afford a gym membership over $10. And there, a lot of those memberships are over $10. So not only will 25% of people not be going back, but, you know, what, what would you say? Tack on another, you know... 10 10 20 percent that won't be able to afford a gym membership so how is la fitness going to be able to survive this economic depression because that's what's coming the an economic depression is here ladies and gentlemen it's not going away anytime soon um and another thing is look at all the Look at all the employee employers that had their employees work from home. I just I think that I just think that this opened up our eyes and it's not going it's not, the virus is not going to kill this economy. This economy was it's a flawed system to begin with. All these huge corporations that received this PPE, you know what they did? I'll tell you what they did. All they're doing is taking that money and giving it back to themselves. That's why the stock market is so pumped up. Let's let's say you've got, you know, ten thousand employees. What are you gonna do? You're gonna get rid of the bottom, the bottom. You're gonna cut the fat at the bottom. So you're gonna get rid of a thousand employees and just pump. All that money that you were gotten right back into the your system, which is the stock market. That's why everything's inflated. Not to mention, all these kids are trying to day trade on Robinhood because they think it's a good idea. I, and I, that's another thing. I wouldn't, as far as comic books and stocks right now, that's the scare. It's, it's scary right now. I'm telling you right now, I, I would, I would shy away from buying anything right now. If if you were smart. And you can see the writings on the wall. I'd be selling hardcore. I'd be selling just about everything I, I've I have, unless something, unless something is, you know, has some sentimental value, you know, like maybe your father got it for you, or your wife, or your girlfriend. Yeah, I, I would hold on to that kind of stuff. But if you have no attachment to anything, I'd be get rid. I'd be getting rid of it this is totally a seller's market a buyer's market is coming what happens is you you know things come come in highs and they come down in lows and they they eventually go back up but i think it's going to be a long time after this is over and then i've got people that are arguing with me telling me that i'm a fear monger i'm, I'm not trying to put fear into anybody i'm trying to help people okay I mean, if this, think about it. If this economy was so good, if it was so great, we'd be able to weather this storm. The government wouldn't be giving us stimulus packages if the economy was so good. And just because our leader says, oh, we've added 5 million jobs in the month of June. No, you didn't. You didn't. You brought jobs back. You're still behind the eight ball. You didn't, you really didn't do anything. And what's going to happen when we lock everything down again? We're going to go we're going to go right back to square one. Guys, subscribe. Remember this, if I got to pay, no way. If it's free, 
it's for me. If it's on credit, forget it. And one more thing, it's not about the quantity of your collection, it's how much you paid for the quantity of your collection. It counts. Thanks, guys.